Maka's guides. <laughs> hey everyone, I'm showing you how to get all the objectives in career mode on the level Venice Beach. First, we're going to start off, as always, with the high score. <clears throat> so I'm just going to show you a really quick combo. Uh, I was able to get it in probably about a minute, a uh, minute and five seconds, using these two combos. And obviously, uh, if you're unable to do as big of a combo, uh, don't even worry about it because you can just repeat them or you can stay in the uh, half pipe that I'll show you in a second. So this is the best place right here to get a combo. Obviously, I screwed up pretty bad and still got the score. Uh, so obviously, don't even worry about screwing up if uh, you do. Uh, as always, try to max out the stats on your character as best as possible for where you, wherever you are in the game. This is this right here is the combo you're looking for. And obviously, I, I don't even know the specials for him. And I was able to get that was an accidental special over 200,000 there, and I did get the six score in one combo. And obviously, um, you're able just to sit in this uh, half pipe here and continue to boost your score. So as you saw, I ended that combo with 280,000, so 80,000 over, and I already managed to get about 50,000 just going back and forth and uh, whatnot. So now we're going for the secret DVD. For the secret DVD, it's actually probably the second uh, most stupid one to get um, because it's all based on like a little bit of luck and how you hit the ramp, and it's not really skill. So anyways, you have to get on top of this roof here, and we're going to hit this quarter pipe just to gain some speed. And then what we're aiming for is this ramp, and we're aiming for that little disc floating above that wire. Um, there's other ways to get it. You can get it with a table, table pop. Um, but that's probably what I recommend. So now we're collecting skate. The S is on top of this roof right here. The K is just off to the left. And you do want to stay on top of the roofs when you get the K. Uh, it makes your life a lot easier when you go for the next few letters. The A is uh, still on top of the roofs. Actually, never mind. We have to go down and then back up. But regardless, uh, on top of the roofs, the A is located right there in that little bend. And um, so you're going to go for that. Now the T is where the seat, you have to make the transfer over to where you got the secret DVD and uh, grab it just floating right above this quarter pipe. And then the last letter is the E, which is kind of the most hidden in the most random spot. It's right there in front of me though. Um, you can see it floating above that quarter pipe. So next we're going for all five spray cans. This is a random order. Of course you can do it in any order. I go for this one first. It's to the left of where uh, you first uh, start your run. And then you're going to go all the way to this green rail and grinding on it will get you that uh, th second spray can. The third spray can right here on the quarter pipe, it's just sitting there. All you have to do is get a little bit of air and it's yours. And now I'm going for the uh, fourth one, I believe. Yep, the fourth one. Uh, there's multiple ways to get it. I'll show you the way I tried to get it and obviously failed. Um, by transferring from one half, one quarter pipe to the other quarter pipe, you can get it, but obviously I went way too high and, and overshot it. So what I did was I grinded myself onto this roof, and then you can just jump off the roof into it, and then we're going to go all the way across the map for the fifth spray can, and um, basically it is where, honestly it's a very hard explanation, so let's just kind of watch here. Um, where you would go up to the secret DVD, just keep left, and there's a little ramp downward there. And at the end of this little section, there's a quarter pipe, and it's right there. I just grabbed it at the top of the quarter pipe. And now we're going to tail slide the Venice Ledge. I Tail slides are really weird. I can't get them, like, 80% of the time. I get them, like, you know, occasionally. But it's either, like, left, uh, left or right, and then uh, grind. I, I don't know. It's a weird thing. Anyways, the Venice ledge itself is uh, right here. You can see the actual sign says ledge. And what we have to do is we have to tail slide all the way from the top, all the way from the bottom. So just experiment with whether it's like left or right or back or front. It's really hard to, to do, honestly. Now we're doing the uh, four VB transfers. And this one's probably the hardest one. Why I'm doing these tricks is to build up my special, which actually makes you go faster. And you have to make it all the way to this far ramp. And that's your first VB transfer. Your second transfer is located right here from this ramp onto this ramp. And you see VB transfer and then, you know, it will say like fatty transfer or like, you know, thin transfer, whatever. And uh, that just, you know, that's to double check whether or not you did the right transfer. 
Your third transfer is from this ramp to this ramp. One of the easier ones there, just don't overshoot it. That one's the skinny transfer. And now I'm moving on to the last one, which is in the same area as where the ledge, where the tail slide was. And you're just gonna go from this ramp right here, and you're gonna go to the right-hand side onto the smaller ramp. For any of these transfers, you can do them the opposite way, and it still will count, but I thought I showed you the easiest path but if you do screw up one of them, you can try doing it the opposite way, and it still will count, although some of them are uh, pretty hard doing that way. Anyways, magic bums, your first magic bum, I just hopped over him right there. And you do have to do these in this exact order. Uh, he will not be in the other spots unless you do it in the order. So there he is for the second, the second time. And now back to the third time, we're going to go basically back to where we came from at the very beginning of the map. And uh, again, in the right order or else you'll just waste time skating around. So the third third magic bomb, well it's not the third magic bomb, it's the first magic bomb in its third place is right there. You see me all in over. And then we're moving on to the fourth one, which is located right in this little section. And we're going on to the fifth place. It's right where you spawn, right at the beginning of the uh, match. I screw up here big time. And uh, But once you do make it back to where we, you started, You'll see him lying there and he's free to grab. And once you do that, if you have gotten all the cash, you will basically get all the goals. So here are all the cash spots. I did a kind of random order. Uh, it's what I thought was the fastest, but <clears throat> who knows. Anyways, the first and second one are on this ledge right here. Uh, pretty easy, just make sure you get up high enough to grind. Your uh, third one is located on this same ledge, just on uh, this side of the map. So you can see it floating there in plain sight. And uh, I'm not sure what I do next, but I, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going to go for a roof. Yep, so just get on the quarter pipe and grind it to get onto that roof. And you can see one floating right there. That's my fourth one. And you can see another yellow one floating on that wire. That's going to be my fifth one after I embarrass myself completely. So once you get the fifth one, you're going to turn around and head the other way to get your sixth, seventh, and eighth one. Um, these ones aren't too bad. There's one or two that are just kind of annoying unless you have like full stats. And I'll show you those near the end. But there's your sixth one. And now you're gonna go for your seventh one right there. And you're gonna go back and onto these little pipes and grind up to get your eighth one. And once you get your eighth one, uh, the next few are a little bit tougher than the previous, but you'll see the easiest ways to get them so that was number eight number nine is on top of these wires and you do have to get a little bit lucky and you grind up here and then you grind onto there and that's my ninth one and then I go for the tenth one which is located um, on the Venice ledge which is where you'll need to do your tail slide for one of the other goals and I'm going to start back at the very beginning of the map just to show you guys where the other two are because it's not worth your time for me to just skate around. Anyways, the 10th one, the 11th one rather, that I went for is in plain sight, but it's probably the hardest one to get. You do have to get off of this ramp and you have to jump really late to land onto that ledge and get that cash. That one honestly took me alone like three or four minutes. But once you do that, you'll just get this last one, which I left for here. And you're done that level. That's Venice Beach totally complete. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope it was helpful. Please like, comment, subscribe, blah, blah, blah.